Austin, what happened? I don't know, it just started. I haven't seen her act like this in years. Not since the incident. The incident? In the tunnels. Oh, please don't bring that up again. I'm not. I'm just saying, I hope no one's fooling around with the tunnels again. Best friend, you should tell him. No way. It'll hurt his feelings. You tell him. I'm not telling him. You tell him. Ah! Gotcha. I hate it when you do that. <laughs> You're gonna turn my fur gray, bro. What were you talking about? You. Me? Yeah. You have to tell Iggy that he stinks at his new gig. You mean his new show thingy? Haven't seen it. It is truly horrendous. Come on, Iggy can't be that bad. See for yourself. And now it's time for our newest feature. Iggy, the Gossip in Iguana. I am the iguana in the know with all the juiciness you want to know, even though you don't know you want to know it. Oh boy, do I have some tasty nibbly things for you today. Prepare to be shocked. What rhino was dusting the bookshelves in the library and uncovered something that no one has seen in years? That's right, Rini Rhino uncovered the top of the bookshelves. Ooh, those babies were dusty. Maybe it's just warming up. And here's the buzz about what happened at the annual butterfly picnic today. A fluttery time was had by all. Ooh. And last but not less, earlier today, Tyrannicus's assistant, Fuchsia, was caught stealing a catnap. Ooh, the scandal, yes? That's all for today. Tune in tomorrow for more juicy scuttlebutt and tooting at the tattletales. I'm not telling him, you tell him. I'm too busy. Doing what? Mapping out all the portal entrances. I'm making a guide so everyone in Animalia can access the tunnels. But something really bizarre happened. What? Well, I heard someone or something scratching inside the tunnel system. What did it sound like? Like that. Where's that coming from? I don't know, but I'm gonna find out. Where are you going? Into the tunnels. Helix, no, wait. There's something I should tell you. How does he do that? Oh, this could be bad. And that's the news. So until next time, this is Melford Mouse. And Iggy the Iguana, don't forget to gossip a lot. Bye-bye. And we're clear. Iggy, the chief wants to see No you. doubt to reward me with many mammalians for my fantastical reportage of dirty clothing. I'm not going to mince words. I'm not a mincy guy. Never have been. Chief, I know what you're going to say. You're going to say... You're fired. Huh? We simply can't afford you anymore. But I'm not being paid. That's what makes this so tough. The fact is, Iggy, your gossip reports are boring. Look at the email we're getting. Iggy, you stink. Get rid of that insipid iguana. Iggy, you handsome devil, you. Keep doing that thing you do so well. Ha! I have one fan. You wrote this, didn't you? Yes, I did. Animalians want to know stuff about other Animalians that the other Animalians don't want them to know, you know? Give me one more chance, oh great nosy one. I am a minor celebrity in my own mind. I promise, if given the chance, I will prove to you and all of Animalia my gossip-mongering abilities. Please! Pathetic groveling warms my heart. All right, one more broadcast. I, Iggy the Iguana, am going to dredge up the dirtiest dish of dirt and serve it up to all of Anamelia on a platter of my own making. But how will I find it? 
Oh, it's just you. Yeah. Stop with the sudden spookity leaping from the portals as you sneak around all over the place and see and hear things that no one wants you to see and hear. Allow me to join you. Uh, sure. But there's something as a friend I need to tell you. My gossip stinks. I know I'm working on it. Hang on! Ah! Ah! What are you looking for? That. That scratching noise. Perhaps it is a famous anamelium with a bad case of fleas. Now that's gossip. I should have a look-see. Oh, activity at the gazebo. <laughs> that tickles. No scratching out there. Just a juicy bit of gossip. It's coming from up ahead. Come on. I think it's coming from out there. I don't think so, Ig. This way. Allow me to see what lies beyond this portal, just to be sure. Nothing out there. Told ya. Nothing except said Zebra discussing something super secretive. That I am gathering some scandalous stuff for my next report. Iggy, you are the smarty with no pants. That Tyrannicus is a double-crossing no-good cat. I appreciate all your help, Egg. I enjoy the selflessness of helping a compadre. It's coming from over there! We are back where you found me! Oh, this is impossible! Hold on! That wasn't there before! I think the scratching's coming from inside! Come on, Egg! I would love to continue, my chum, but it is almost time for my next mudslinging broadcast. Bye bye Bad feeling about this. Uh, maybe just one little peek. And now, against our better judgment, it's time once again for. <laughs> Iggy the Gossip in Iguana. And believe you me, I have all the low-down gossip all you low-down animalians don't think you want to know about, but do. Uh, what's the gossip? Oh, yes. What creature has a big old secret that even Z doesn't know about? Yes, Z is planning a big fat surprise party for Z. Oh! A little birdie inside my head told me that Fuchsia thinks her boss Tyrannicus is a double-crossing liar who cannot be trusted. What? He made that up, total no. What rhino boss of mine is secretly getting his big fat toesies pedicured in the gazebo? He may be tough, but Rumble's tootsies are soft as can be. Get me, Iggy, now! How tough are Harry and Horrible Hog? They are secretly learning the two-step for the upcoming Animalian Day. What's wrong with Arby, eh? Expand your horizons and all that! Just as long as I lead. And lastly but not measly, what striped shirted stink bug is traveling the tunnel system in search of a spookity scratching sound? I want to see Iggy. Immediately! This is Iggy the Iguana saying, may all your gossip be packed with juiciness. Looks like Ig dug up the dirt. Whoa! Oof. Sounds like Alex just hit the dirt. Must have found a sky portal. Alex, are you okay? Uh, fine, thanks, <laughs> I think. Alex, I'm so glad to see you, dude. We need to talk. About what? About what you're doing. Going inside those tunnels could be major dangerous. Dangerous how? There was a time when the core was working perfectly. The portals were a part of our lives. They allow animalians to travel from one location to the next instantly. That is so cool. For sure. Everyone in Animalia could see the portals, and it was a good time. The quiet time. Then came what they call the incident. The core erupted? Yeah. And a very important core spore was lost. The portal spore. So the portals to the tunnels became invisible to every animalian. Except one. A creature known only as the Creeper. The Creeper? Most don't remember him. I know I don't. But those who do remember, they speak of his dark legend. The Creeper had a gift like yours, Alex. He could see the hidden portals. 
But unlike you, he wasn't good-hearted. He used the portal so he could steal from animalians, spy on them, cheat them. What happened to the Creeper? The Creeper brought a few animalians with him into the tunnels, charged him a load of mammalians to give him a tour. It was supposed to be a three-hour tour, but they became lost, and no one ever came back. That explains the scratching. There are animalians trapped in the tunnels. I have to rescue them. Alex, wait! Don't go in there! Whoa. Congrats, Iggy. The grapevine is ringing off the branch. Everyone is calling in about your report. So I can keep my non paying job? No! You're fired! Never gossip about your boss! Now get out and don't come back! Ever! Uh, could things get any worse? Livingston wants to see you now! And boy, is he miffed! <sighs> Here's Iggy. Forgive me. I stuck my nose in where it should not be stuck. Gossiping is a wrong, bad, icky thing. I know this because everyone is mad at me, including you. Iggy, I'm not mad at you. Good for me. I'm not happy with you either. Rats for me. I want you to tell me what's going on with Alex. All I know from what I can recall from within my head is that Alex is searching for a scratching noise. A scratching noise? Livingston! Alex was yanked into a portal! I think he's in trouble! What can we do? We need to find a way into the tunnels and save him. But Alex is the only one that can see the portals! How will we get inside? I have no idea. Whoa! Oh. <clears throat> Hello? I won't hurt you. I want to help you get out of here. Help me. Someone, help me. Hello? Who are you? I'm afraid the way the court is acting, all the portals could shut down permanently. Then Alex would be trapped in the tunnels forever? Hold it. Alex's sketchbook. We may not be able to see them, but thanks to Alex, we know where some of them are. Hmm. He found a lot of portals. We're going to need some help. Iggy, what I do now? I need you to do one more broadcast. I was fired, booted, sacked with extreme get out and don't come back in this. This is important, Iggy. I need you to go on air and tell all of Animalia to come to the library and help with the search. I shall do what must be done, even though I have no idea how to do it. Fare thee well. Dear viewers, the final chapter of my undercover investigation of How Grass Grows. Wake me up when it's over. Iggy, be not afraid. Be the other way. You must help save Alex. Magic man, I believe. It's done with mirrors. So, join me here by the gazebo. And let's watch the grass grow together. This was a tough journey, but I believe I grew as much as the grass did. <sighs> Tomorrow, Melford finds out if a watched pot really does boil. <laughs> Citizens of Animalia, I come to tell you something of great importance. Not more gossip! Stop him! I'm on it, Chief. <laughs> Our beloved stink bug Alex is in grave danger. He was sucked into a portal and is lost inside the tunnels. We need every animalian to come to the library and help in the search. Gotcha! <laughs> no one hijacks my broadcast! Who, who, who are you? What are you? I'm a human. Oh, no way. Humans don't exist. They're just rumored to exist. <laughs> Pure gossip. They exist, and I'm one of them. My name is Alex. An actual human, huh? Not too hairy. Oh, interesting. Uh, call me TC. What kind of animal are you? 
I'm a member of the mink and ferret family, a long-tailed weasel. So, human Alex, what brings you here? I heard a rumor that there may be animalians lost in the tunnels, so I followed the sound of you scratching, and here I am. So, you're, you're here to, to, to rescue me? I suppose I am. You're the best. But who's going to rescue you? Well, what do you mean? Well, I've been down here for quite some time, and, and I can't find a way out. Oh. I take it you humans don't do a lot of planning ahead, huh? Huh. <laughs> Guess not. I propose an iguana free animalia. All those in favor, say aye. aye. Do not be still angry with my small head. I knew not what I did, and now I do know, and this time I am telling the truth. Iggy wasn't gossiping this time. Alex really is lost inside the tunnels. And we need your help to find him. We have a map that will show you where some of the portals are. Now, even though you won't be able to see the portals, you must trust the map. Be great, I can't wait. You coming? I want to, more than you know, but I need to keep the core from shutting down. Okay. I've made copies of Alex's map. Here's what we're going to do. So, have you seen any of the others? Others? There are others down here? That's the rumor, including some creature called the Creeper. <gasps> the Creeper? Don't mention that name, that, that, that monster! You've seen her. Human Alex, the Creeper is the one who tricked me into coming here. Why? The Creeper has some grudge against Livingston. And since I was Livingston's best pal, that monster lured me in here. Awful. Livingston never told me. It's probably too painful for him to speak of. I know it is for me. Well, hang in there, TC. I'll find us a way out. And then you can see your pal Livingston again, all right? Alex, my human friend, that would be the best. My super Iggy senses tell me we are nowhere near a portal entrance. Ah! Except for maybe this one. Let's check out the next exit. <laughs> How come you know so much about these tunnels? My super Iggy senses are so super sensitive that Alex told you. Yes, he did. I've been round and round these tunnels. I've seen it all, and like I told you, there is no way out. Have you tried that? What? There's nothing there. There's a portal right behind you. Impossible! I can see every... Lead the way, Alex. Lead the way. Whoa. You've locked us in a chamber with no exits. What have you done? Wait, look! It's some sort of ancient writing. It's the old Animalian alphabet. Check this out. Uh, uh. Hmm. What? I don't see anything. Yeah. for a few seconds. One of us will need to hold the button, the other one can go through. You go. Once you get free, you can return with help. No, I couldn't leave you here. You have powers like I've never seen. Don't worry about me. I've been trapped down here for so long that no one even... No, you go, TC. Find Livingston, then you can both come back for me. Human, you are the kindest creature I've ever met. When I say jump, jump!
Toei. We've been searching everywhere for you, little bro. Now let's get you out of here. Oh, big problem. Once I push the button, there isn't enough time for all of us to get out. <laughs> I got me a bongo berry nut. Just tell us when to jump. Allow me to introduce Anna Amelia's new gossip reporter, Allegra. I am ten times the gossip that she is. Hi, y'all. What iguana named Iggy still sucks his thumb when he sleeps? That is so untrue. I never did that very often. And even if I did, it's no one's business but mine. <laughs> <laughs> what? So what happened in the tunnels, Alex? All sorts of weird stuff. For one thing, I met an animalian who was stuck in there. Who? A funny little guy named TC. Some kind of ferret or mink or something. I helped him escape, or at least I tried to. Have you seen him? Nope. Well, I sure hope he made it out. <laughs> oh, I made it out, Alex, thanks to you. But the letters TC are just my initials. My full name is... The Creeper. The Creeper is back. 